Hey guys, this is D from Tech Shop 82. Um, just doing a quick kind of investigation into the Cosmo app. So a new one came out that added a new bunch of features. It actually allowed the dev bots, which are these guys, the ones with the USBs on the back, to actually work with the Cosmo app. This was the final version of the app that Anki was working on before um, they went bankrupt. But um, DDL recently just released a new version and people are saying it's having issues. So now I'm going to try it on iOS, which I think is where the issue is. So let's go ahead and connect to my Cosmo. This is an iPhone 6. I don't have iOS devices, so this is the, this is the one I have to test with. So Cosmos connecting. So the first thing people said is he can no longer recognize your face. Because so we're we're gonna go ahead and try that. So I'm gonna give him my name. And then now it's looking at me. Okay, so that's what they're saying happens. He just keeps dinging over and over and over and over again. So that's confirmed that one. I'm going to quit this. And then the other one is he can no longer speak. So in, in Cosmo Performs, because this is the first time I'm doing this, it's going to make me go through the tutorial. So I tap Excited. He does the excited animation. But then when it wants me to add text, I'm gonna say peas. So right now he's not saying anything. So, let me go get my other tablet that has both on there, and then I can test that just to verify that's an iOS thing. So, let me go get that. This is the old app. This is a new one. So, I'm going to open up the new one. You can tell with the Anki logo that shows up, it'll be gray. The background will be gray, so it'll be blue to gray. If you see blue and white, then that means you're, you have the old one. For some reason, the version doesn't show in iOS. I don't know why, but this one says 3.6.6. .6. iOS doesn't show the version. So I'm going to connect. So it's connecting. Waking up. Okay, so it's awake. Now, I think on this one I've done meet Cosmo and he knows who I am, but let's go ahead and do it again. I'm gonna do D. Okay, standing off to the side, he sees my face. Yeah, that's what he's supposed to do. And then he says my name. And then Cosmos learned to recognize your face. So now I'm on there. So that's what it's supposed to do. Um, let's go to Cosmo Performs. And like I said, I've already done this before. So I'm just going to play what, what I have here. So clearly the Android one is wa working, but the iOS one isn't working. So in the next bit, I'm going to show you how to downgrade your Cosmo. Unfortunately, you can only use the old app 
with Android because I don't know how to downgrade the iOS app, but I'll show you how to downgrade your Cosmo. To downgrade, so I have the old and the new one here. So on Cosmo's face, it says 01 because I disconnected the app. You know, on the new one, if you see this battery bar here, but to downgrade, you're going to want to go up and down to go into this information screen. And you're going to go down and up. It'll go blank and then down and up again. And then you see the hidden menu. And from here, you can take them off the charger and then just scroll with the wheel till you get to factory reset. The way you get there, just go up and down. And then it's now reset into factory default. And then you can put them back on the charger and wait for them to come back to life. It doesn't, it re really doesn't take that long. Well, I better wait for them to finish. Okay, so charging indicator is back. And as you can see, well, as you can see, there's no longer uh well my stuff is bright here but there's no longer a charging indicator indicator in the top right so with that done so this is the newer app this is the older one that i installed through apk pure on android i don't know if you, you might be able to do the same thing on ios but i don't know how i don't have an apple device but when you install 3.4.4 and connect to your Cosmo. So I'm going to connect to Cosmo now. If it does decide to show up. There he is. His credentials remain the same, so you don't have to like do anything to change that. And if you're on Android, you'll get a pop-up saying there's no internet. Do you want to keep this connection? Make sure to select yes. So what I'm going to do then is launch the old one. And when the old one launches, it'll say 3.4.4 or 3.4.0 over there. And then once you connect, it will install the older firmware on him, which it's doing now. And if your Cosmo is in good condition and there aren't any issues with it, this, this part shouldn't take long. If this part is taking longer than, I don't know, a minute and a half, you probably have a bad battery or there's something else um, wrong with your Cosmo. So it's installed. And then Cosmo's rebooting. The kind of boot loop in this area because, oh, it actually connected. <laughs> So that's how you downgrade your Cosmo. Um, so I'm gonna put him back to sleep. Well, I need to wait for him to finish waking up so I can put him right back to sleep. Or I can just kill the app. And that automatically disconnects. It should, it should show an error on his face. Yeah, Cosmo 01, meaning the app got closed. But then when you put it back on the charger, you'll see he has, there's no charge, there's no charging icon in the top right. And he's been reset back to his old firmware version. So if you're having issues with the new Cosmo app and you need to downgrade, that is how you do it. Anyways, I'll continue investigating this firmware because... Yeah, I've been having some battery and, con well, I've been having some connectivity issues and I am not sure what's going on, but if I hear anything new, I will let you know. All right, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.